Howdy fellas, we were getting ready to drill and install the ramrod pipes and I mentioned in an earlier video about the little guide they send with you. you know, send with the kit, you can see it right there, it inserts in the pre-drilled hole. You just push that in there till you feel it contact the, the metal. Then you thread this little tiny drill bit and you want to be sure you tighten it down. Good and tight in there and make sure it's sticking through. You don't put a whole lot of pressure on it because it, you know, it's a tiny drill bit, it may snap. So, all right, I just heard it break through, so I pulled that back out so I can set the guide aside now and take my wrench. Loosen that collet and tighten it around real tight to get that little bitty tiny drill bit in there. Alright, now we're going to switch to the 1 16th of an inch drill bit. You've got your pile of hole drilled. Gonna be <clears throat> Put it in the collet. Take your little 5 16 wrench and tighten it down real good. Thread it back in the hole. Oh, my clamp just came loose. Okay. And I felt it go through. So you want to stop right there. Okay. Set that drill aside. Don't need any more right now. And also, our drill bit. We're going to take, they supply uh, about four or five pieces of this music wire. This is a short piece that I've already used some of it. So, what you're going to do is take your file. And you're going to make sure you get any burrs on the end of that all. So, what you're going to do is go across the end of it and then start going around and filing the lead on that. And that's also making sure you don't have any burrs on that pin. Alright, that should be good enough. So you're going to insert that little wire into that hole. Take a little hammer. Okay, I just felt it come through, so I'm going to release my clamp, and I'm going to pack that back. Let me get up where I can see. I'm going to have to get down, Assistant Jake. Okay, got that pin pushed back, back flush. So, I'm going to fudge a little bit and leave the ramrod pipes on there because I don't want to have to take those on and off again. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this little bitty hacksaw bit and hopefully mark that well enough that I can see. Nope, didn't hardly get it good enough, so let's try that again. If I can see it now. Yeah, okay. Alright, now I'm going to take, you can't see this on camera what I'm fixing to do. Got a little bench vise over here. I'm going to temp, if I can see what I'm doing. Go. Let's 
this is what when you get old this is what happens to you you get where you can't say stuff real good let's try that one more time trying to do this where I want to. Let's try the hacksaw blade one more time. I believe I may see it right there. So we'll do, do this way. Got a pair of heavy pliers. And there's two things that I play there. Number one, I don't believe it's going to be long enough. But anyhow, you get the, the idea of what I'm doing. So. I'm going to have to back up and punt. I'm not getting that mark good enough. I can see it. And I'm just going to have to work with it. That's what you have to do with this. Just take your time and work with it till you get it. God bless you. Thanks for watching. Keep your powder dry. Mind you, top not pilgrim.